chat and he's just going to say uh, uh, a few words. Uh, your name? Wakim. Wakim. So this is Wakim. I can talk English as well. Oh, you can. Very good, mashallah, right? Yeah. So he's going to tell you about the Ocean City uh, Resort. So Wakim, tell us all about this place, a little bit of the history, uh, who you're looking to um, attract to this place, yeah. and where is it going in the future? Inshallah, it's going in the future very well because uh, it in Hakkakar they will spend a lot of money on that. Mashallah. And uh, for now, we're looking for people that can uh, come here and uh, can spend the night here. And ob obviously, it's secure. We got like a four security guards to protect you. And the rest of the building, I can uh, show you if you want. Okay, mashallah. So. So if somebody from the United Kingdom, yeah. let's say, wants to come and stay here for for a week, yeah. what would be what would they have to do? How would they book? What would their charges be? What would uh, Ocean Development City provide for website, them? So okay, it'd be much easier for them to book it online. If for now they can contact me or they can contact Shahzad, the guy that owns the building, that employs Kakati Sons. So he can tell me that like I'm booking for them. So the checkout time is uh, 12 p.m. Okay. And after that, it's like a daily. So every day, it's be charged depending on the rooms. Okay. So they got small rooms starting for thousand. Four thousand. Yeah. And then it's going up to five thousand, and the apartment is start from seven thousand. Okay. So great. Two apartments. We got two apartments. Okay. We got 12. Or 11 big rooms and the small rooms I think 12 or something. Okay. So it all depends on the room that you're looking for. Fabulous. So if somebody wanted to let's say stay in the small room yeah. for 4,000 rupees, is that just a charge for 24 hours or does that include breakfast and meals and it's things like that? It's not breakfast yet because we haven't opened the restaurant yet. Okay. But even if you open it, that's going to be excluded. It's not going to be included. Okay. And uh, and the, the thing that it'll be checkout time 12 p.m. Whether you come daytime after 12 or you come night, it'll be checkout 12 p.m. Fabulous. Yeah. Okay. And when is the supermarket and the restaurant likely to open? It'll be inshallah within a month. Within hopefully. a month. Yeah. Okay. If it, everything goes well. Okay. Great. So Jazakallah for your time. God bless you. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala put uh, barakah in this, in, in this project. Uh, my, my name is Javes Khan. Uh, my original village is Malau. Uh, my my uh, fa father, uh, Marhum, is known as uh, Rasul Khan. So we're very, very, uh, very close to Vesa. Um, I've grown up with people from Vesa. Um, they've looked after me ever since I was minus one, one, one years inshallah. old. Inshallah. So, next time, yeah. inshallah. so this this village has wonderful people. Inshallah. They're greatly inshallah. hospitable. They have honor. Um, well, they have honor and dignity. <laughs> G? It comes with uh, both hands in it. You are good as well. Alhamdulillah. So, yeah. Alhamdulillah. Thank you. Thank you. Jazakallah. Okay. You Thank you for inshallah. your time. Um, I'm a, a Bradfordian. So here's the gent. Look. <laughs> There's a gent, look, and he, uh, he uh, lived in the UK for about uh, uh, eight years. So, you know, it gives you a little bit of uh, more background about this place. Now look, there has to be everything, but there has to be a chai place. Chai, guys. But regular means of transport in Pakistan, bicycles, motorbikes, lots and lots of motorbikes. So as we start to come to the end of this, this blog, what can I say to you? So we're heading back in uh, towards Vesa, uh, towards the uh, Vegano Adda and it's getting more livelier <laughs> as the weather cool, cools down a little bit people are coming out and visiting the local shops and visiting their cousins and 
and doing the daily chores that they were not able to do during the hours where it was extremely hot and as we come back in and in the corner over there look where you can see the bank of something hides Suleiman Market Suleiman Kakaji's Market if you watch it in, in, in Bradford Suleiman Kakaji I'm sorry I couldn't cover the play the old Ford Transmate and a guy selling some mangoes that's why he's shouting and screaming look. so look he's getting busier and busier fruit uh, watermelons melons mangoes uh, look like apples are uh, being sold are being sold by the roadside which is Zakaria, I believe it's further on on the right hand side. And there's look. Another chai place, although it's not a call of chai anything. Hello. The PTI must be an office. In Pakistan you're either PTI or you're non-PTI or you're the Sharifs or you're you're a noon league or you're a Pakistan Muslim League. Um, and you belong to one of them. As the motorbikes waste past look, simple life. People just sat outside chatting. No Facebook, no WhatsApp, no no crop chat, no Mo Facebook. Mosin, Mosin. Oh and here you go, Mosin, Mosin Freshco Bradford, Masaud, your house by <laughs> So as I was saying, no social media, no WhatsApp, no Facebook, no Snapchat, no Tumblr, no Google, no Badai. People are sat around just having a good old chat and a good old gossip. The markets on the left hand side, continuous construction, continuous work. This bit definitely needs a little bit of work. It does not smell nice. Now look, there you go, Bank Al Falah. And Iqbal Allah's house on my left hand side. Saadat Kakaji, God bless his soul. Faisal Fizi, I believe this is that their house. And here on the left hand side, look, we have Kashi Vatsaki Iqbal house as well. Ahmad Khan Allah's house as well. All Bradfordians love you guys and we're now in the Sheikh Abad Ada shop on the corner there just behind these houses known for its uh, jalebi and if you find kebab it's easily available in these areas guys sat under the tanduru with his feet up one of the first places that has been or was developed okay in this whole area is oops can't see it's too dark <laughs> b and j bakers cash and cash and carry um, a shop which has many amenities and would be visited by people like me from from abroad because uh, they brought to to the market modern products so look we are sitting behind the counter here Assalamu alaikum. So these guys here brought uh, a, a modern type of shopping. Okay, where things look <laughs> from the little things that we love. One of the reasons why we'll not we wouldn't migrate to Pakistan is because we we would miss the little things like the fish and chips, the 99 pence burger. So they brought a whole load of look just Western type of uh, goods to to the market from foods and achars and oils and pastries and. So as I was recording the video, like usual, the battery finished. So what I was saying about B and J was that Vesa is a is is a village, and B and J uh, pioneer.
Hope you've enjoyed the uh, the vlog. God bless you. Uh, have a wonderful, blessed day. My name is Javez Khan. Pakistan, Zindabad.